It bothers me when doctors pressurize patients into transferring two or three embryos at a time. I think this is completely unethical and unacceptable. And the reason doctors do it is because they have no confidence in their embryology lab. They don't think their embryos are very good quality. And they want to put back more embryos at one time with the hope that at least one will stick. And they feel their job is done once they've done the embryo transfer because, hey, I put good quality embryos. And if the patient didn't get pregnant, that's the patient's problem. But the reality is this is extremely irresponsible because all good clinics all over the world transfer only a single embryo. And this is a blastocyst, what's called a day five embryo. So if your doctor is suggesting that they transfer day three embryos or they transfer two or three embryos at a time, this should be a red flag because they're not advising this in your best interests. They're advising this in their interests because once they put the embryo, they can say, hey, I did everything possible and your IVF cycle was good as far as I was concerned. If the cycle fails, then that's on you, not on me. But the reality is the IVF cycle failed because the doctor did not wait till day five before putting the embryo back because they didn't have confidence in the laboratory and they pushed the embryos back on day three. Now a day three embryo does not belong in the uterus. It either belongs in the fallopian tube or it belongs in the incubator. So any doctor who puts a day three embryo back in the uterus and tells you that's better for the embryo is lying to you because a day three embryo is not in the uterus. It only reaches the uterus in the human body after day five. It spends that much time in the fallopian tube so that you have to be on your guard and don't get carried away by misleading information because this is going to harm you. So please don't allow doctors to cheat you. You need to be well informed so you can put your foot down.